45. The bid is at 45, 50, 55, 60, 65,000. Are there any other bids? Oh, come on now, ladies and gentlemen, we're just warming up. Any bids higher than 65, 70, 70,000? Oh, do I see 75? 75. 100,000. The lady in the back offers 100,000. Any bids higher than 100,000? Anyone offering 105? The bid is now at 100,000. 105,000. 150,000. The lady in the back offers 150,000. Any bids higher than 150,000? Finally, we're approaching the true value of this famous holy sword. Are there any bids higher than 150,000 pounds? Any bids? 300,000. Oh, what an exciting auction. This gentleman seems determined to win it. Believe me when I say this sword is worth every penny. Undeniably, 300,000 pounds is a very attractive bid. Let's see if anyone wants to offer 305,000 pounds. Do I see 305? Not 300. Any higher than 300,000. I say 300,000 going once, 300,000 going twice. 400,000. 400,000. I'm pleased to announce the conclusion of the bid at 400,000 going once, going twice. No! Hi. Congratulations on the purchase of your sword. You've done quite well, too, selling the sword at such a high price. Uh, yeah. Nice car. Want a lift? Okay. Wait! What is it? Your car is nice, but the wind's gonna mess up my hair. I'd rather take my own car. I can drive slower. Go. Room 206. Thanks. Mr. Chan, your message is... Oh, thank you. Wow, there's so many. Urgent. Please call back. Help. Please call my cellular phone. I'm booking a flight. I'm trying to get a seat. Please wait for me. I'm flying to you right now to seek your help. I'm at the airport. Be there shortly. Don't go away. Where on earth are you? I'm waiting in the lobby. It's a matter of life and death. <laughs> Come at once, only you can help me. Jackie! Laura's been kidnapped? How much do they want? I have money, it's not that. Well, if they don't want money, then how can I help? You've come to the wrong person. You know what they want? They're asking for the armor of God. The armor of God? Yeah, that armor you said was worth a lot. But I just sold the holy sword. Well, you have to buy it back. The armor of God consists of five pieces, but I only know the whereabouts of three. Where are they? Two of the pieces were sold to a baron. A woman bought the third. They should be easy to find. Finding them is not the problem, and why should I help you? How can you say that? Don't you care about Laura? Leave my feelings for her out of this. Well, how about doing it for our friendship, then? What makes you think we're still friends? <laughs> What's that? We played in the sandbox together, started a band together, even chased after the same girls. How dare you say something like that? <laughs> Don't you remember? You used to kick sand in my face. You kicked me out of the band because my voice was too gravelly. When I was dating Laura, you stole my pants. You've got no shame at all. Oh. I get it. You hate me because I won Laura's love. You didn't win. I just backed off because I didn't want to ruin our friendships. There! So you admit we are friends! We were, but not anymore. I didn't know you were so heartbroken because of her. I shouldn't have come for you. I'll rescue her somehow. I just hope she's still alive. <laughs> Have you finished all the ginseng? that I sent you? I finished it two years ago. I really like the stamps you sent me. I was in such a hurry. I didn't have time to buy anything. 
I just brought you some preserved bean curd. Ah, it's spicy. Just forget about it. I know I'm stubborn. No, you're not. I am stubborn. Okay, you're stubborn. I don't want to argue anymore. What are you planning to do? I'm not sure if I should rescue her. Why? You may not know it, but what I value most is the great friendship that I have with you. I don't want to lose you because of the situation with Laura. Goodbye. Hold it! <laughs> How do we contact the kidnappers? Well, they give me a map. They want me to get the pieces of the armor first and then bring them to a small town. There I can exchange them for Laura. Let's talk to the Baron first to see if we can borrow his pieces. And then we'll try to find the woman who bought the sword. Hey, do you know what the sign says? I think. Why do I even bother to ask? Is there a bell? <laughs> Anybody home? The home is over there. Excuse me, please come with me, gentlemen. Hey, I think I know what that sign said. More I can figure that out. The owner of this must really hate deer. Deer hunting is a European pastime. Oh, oh, oh. Raven's chamber. He's only let loose at night. Now, gentlemen, please come this way. So, do you want to borrow the armor to prevent some sort of global disaster? It's not that serious. If I may, my girlfriend's been kidnapped. They want the armor. They'll kill her. Isn't that serious enough? Well, for me, any person's life is considered important. Yet, it can also be unimportant. If I decided to loan you the armor of God in order to save your girlfriend's life, then in that same philosophy, I should donate all my property in order to save the poor, starving masses in Africa. I only want to borrow the pieces. I promise I'll return them to you. Can you guarantee that? Yes, I can. <laughs> Even if you can, I have no reason to trust you. Then let me buy them from you. <laughs> Look around. Do you really think I have any interest in money? <laughs> Why don't we change the subject for a moment? You've come all this way. Would you gentlemen care to see my antique collection? Uh-uh, I'm not interested in antiques. Wait, I love antiques. Ah. So we are two of a kind, then. Please, follow mm. me. Wait. Oh. It's incredible. Wow. So many antiques. It's like a small museum in here. <laughs> 